Like this team is so fire. Everyone Magma Ulti actually that, so that uh, can't over the CG mass for uh, round six losers bracket, I think. So we do see um I think a Zard X actually. Because That is a threat. This team is like a bit annoyed by Toxapex otherwise, so I just would have figured that he's X. But yeah, looking at this, this is like the team that ABI used, right? And Snake Draft. He yeah. could have changed the sets, but the team that ABI used was a uh, Scarf Trend. Common Stored Power, Ladi, Defensive Rocks, Lando, Cosmic Power, Common, Softball, Clef with Moonblast. So it was just like a Bro, weird... I think the Ladi just wins. Weird set. So yeah, looking at Kanto's team, I assume it's a Scarf, Keldeo, um, Z move, Bulo or Magina. Hmm. It's definitely AV Magina. Okay. Yeah, it's AV Magina for sure. I mean, all, uh, there's also. Hmm. I mean, AV makes sense, but he has Kaldeo and mm -hmm. Bulu. Yeah. I know he's not. He's still weak to Protein Grand, but he could <coughs> check the other Grand. I guess it has to be AV to check opposing Magina here. Yeah. That makes, yeah, that and makes Protein sense. Grand. Maybe it's Dual Dance Bolt Beam, but I don't, I'm not sure. AV would be logical, and then move Bulu. Yeah, it's definitely Rock's land, so. um, probably defensive on Kanto's team. Yeah. And some defensive Zapdos, and then the Zardex is a mystery because it could always be SD, Flame Charge, Dragon Rush. <laughs> well, that's sad, so. Ooh, the Scarf Trend is a threat. You never know. I mean, if it's DD Earthquake. He, j he has to, like, get. You think it's DD? No, I've I don't know, but, like, he has. Time. I have seen it DD yesterday, actually. He has to weaken the Lando, and. Then Zard can destroy Sijumas. But the problem with DD is, um, DD 3 attacks is like rare as fuck. And if you DD 3 attacks, you get worn down from Flabbit's recoil. That's a problem. Because if you don't have Drain Claw, you get walled by Lari. Roost uh, 3 attacks looks like it puts in some work Yeah, Roost 3 attacks is really good though. Hopefully it's dead set. Yeah, I like that set best. Yeah, but if the Clef gets a cosmic power, it's GG. Oof. I mean, it kinda is actually. Bro, where are the counters? Um, Maybe Bulu can pressure it by SDing, but that's it. Cafeba wins this, yeah, if it's a set. What the fuck? And the psychic resist is like Magirna. Let's hope he's which SD Lottie Zarn. Can like on. I think I think like he can pressure with Bulu and he can like paralyze it with Zapdos, but like that's the only countermeasure. So I assume that like, you know, that uh Sijumas just has a little bit more speed and he Sijumas has helmet, Kanto is lefty, they're both defensive. Um Kanto, yeah exactly. Since Kanto is slower, he was gonna switch there and Sijuma makes a fire play in predicting that. So now he's gonna go Pex. Oh, Ladi, but I don't think he wants to let the Ladi get burned since he can win the game. I think Ladi's better because it uh, pressures the defog more. Yeah, what if it gets burned? Like, Ladi can kind of win here. Yeah. But the Ladi is like, the Ladi is like sub. The Ladi is sub con mine, so. If, like, Kanto has, like, Toxic on Zapdos and it gets up a sub on the on the Toxic, that would be fire. But Kanto probably knows the team as well. Yeah, see, he doesn't want to let the Ladi get burned because Ladi can just win. Ladi and Clef both can win. Looking, looking good for a C2 Master here. That team is so fire. annoying too. But this game one is a best of three. Um, the loser's gonna be out of the tour. Because loser's bracket obviously. The winner is in finals? Loser's no, the, finals? no, no, the winner of, um, is in, I think, semis from loser's bracket. Okay. I'm not, yeah. Did he double the train? Ooh, body. Okay. Kind of interesting. Um, so Kanto's probably gonna vault out here. He could sub this guy this hat too. He can sub on a Florican. If it's not Ice Beam, then he would get a minus and special attack. Someone PM me. No sub idea. would be kind of no icy on the ball switch. Kind of clean play. Probably Dennis yeah, asking. I don't know how he like beats like beats that afterwards. Yeah, he does sub. Yeah, okay. Sub. Yep. Oh I'm, my god. Is this GG? Like what? Like I don't yeah, know. Yeah, like. This, um, like, this is why this team is so good. Lottie and Clef are so slept on right now. This is really tough. I'm pretty sure, like, once he gets plus two, he has to uh, flare. If he comments up, so. HP Ice doesn't break the sub. I think the game is just over here. Yeah. It's looking, it's looking kind of over. Like, from right from the get goes, ABR team is. A uh, yeah, GG. He defogs, yeah. he gets another calm mine, and it's over. <laughs> so, that was a nice game one. Hey, he can come out again here. Like,. Bulu could have potentially. The Bulu has to SD first and break the sub first to put pressure on Ladi, so even that. I'm pretty sure plus two, plus two, Bulu dies. Though. Yeah. If plus two doesn't die, plus three dies. Like, Ladi's insane, dude. Now I'm just trying to yeah, think how he could have potentially really prevented great. that. I don't think he could have. A really tough matchup. This yeah, thing is allowed in UU. This is, this is correct. This is allowed in UU. 
I don't know why. <laughs> I should I should actually play you a bit with this monster. And people want yeah, to ban. Yeah, it's not as good though. I people want to ban Rewell too. If Rewell is gone, this thing's like even better. Yeah. Is Hirachi gone from you yet? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Hirachi is gone. I mean, Jirachi but loses like, the store power as well. Like, store power, like, at plus 6 destroys Jirachi. Doesn't matter that you four times oh. resisted. How did it destroy your defensive Rachi? Yeah, Wadi is insane. Like, there was, I mean, there was like, RMT last gen, um, co like, Comet Ladi, um, like, store power Ladi. Like, Jirachi dying to a four times resisted move was the name of the, the RMT. Um, but Maybe yeah. If he it hurts a lot? <laughs> yeah, but he's a solver, so like he yeah. I, he would be lefties if he was hard swap. So like he, that's not an option. And he would have got it there. Yep. Does hard swap so, go through sub? I think it does. I assume it does, yeah. But yeah, if this game is like really yeah, close and it ends really soon, then we might just um put the entire series in one video. I mean, this should it should end in a few turns. <laughs> it should. I Ice, Ice Beam is not even gonna break the sub anymore, okay? Whoa. I think that crit might matter. that break? Mm, I don't think it does. Ladios is fast. I think he's gonna sub down again here. And if it breaks... I doubt it breaks, honestly. Wait, can't he just start yeah. spamming store power? Yes. Yeah, okay, now he can break. start spamming store power, I think. Oh, he can roost here, I guess. He can, yeah. can recover up, then sub again, and then start spamming. Basically. Well... Critical hit that probably matters. do everything dies. Yeah, this is about to drop that. Yeah, yeah, this doesn't matter. What a follow. Um, right? Zad, why would like HP investment probably d still dies? <laughs> like, I'm just trying to think of something that could live because Zadwai gets a spit death. I mean, Zard, Zard, why with HP investment lives probably, but then what is it gonna do back? Dragon Pulse crit the unset on a low that's low ladder people like to use. <laughs> like, I know, I know that's not a set, but low ladder people use that. Or oh, it's like. Back in Auras, when like. People used Zard X to like sometimes to switch into Zard Y, right? Then you could run Dragon Pulse. <laughs> oh, damn, slow and lost with the team. But he's still I playing level God. 56. Is that for Snake or is that for. Oh, Smog Tour. Oh, Smog Tour. Okay. So he just dies and GG. So it's turn 11, it's a 6 already. Amazing. I mean, it's been over for like three turns. We would have known. Like we knew already. So like this team, it's known, but he couldn't do anything about it. From team period was over. Um, yeah, I still have. Actually, yeah, you guys will already have seen Kanto series from last year um, versus Googly. I will upload that before this. I make sure to upload that before because I don't want to spot that who won that. I mean, it's obvious that Kanto won. So dumb. Huh? That was so dumb. Which game? The Megalati one. Just, it just wins. Yeah. Well, let me pause real quick and be right back with game two. Trial of Wisdom. Oh, back with game two. We got some juicy offense here. With the Diggers B. Looks like something Ember would use. Got the Meteor on deck as well. Um, probably a Solvus Magnezone because it's pretty weak to Greninja. Extremely weak. And too. looking at Sejuma's team. Uh, Mega, Alakazam, probably. Uh, Bantar. Uh, potential Z-move SD Kartana or Scarf Kartana? I think Scarf makes sense. Maybe Scarf Kartana plus, um... His team is Lando, really slow, um, so it has to be either Scarf Kartana or Scarf Lando. I mean, like, Mega Zem, I know Mega Zem is fast, but like, it's still like... It's no Scarf. Not outspeed by opposing Scarf, exactly. And it also gets walled by some stuff. Um, yeah, but that's where Bantar comes in, I guess. It could be dual hazards Pharaoh here plus some offensive Lando shit. Yeah, but I'm just thinking defensive Lando because he's a bit weak to Zygarde and uh, Spikes Pharaoh. So like defensive Rocks Lando and Spikes Pharaoh. But they have picks, obviously. I mean, yeah, if you trap the Lottie, you can get a hazard, so. Yeah, it could be. Um, problem here, what I really see, like, it could be defensive Lando and like, yeah, the Zygarde is, is a thing. But would it be like some defensive Z-move or something? Because he doesn't have a Z-move. I don't know. It could also just be no Z-move, but... Maybe I think Scarf, Lando, Z-Move, Cartana, then Dual Hazard, Sparrow. Let me make you guys a bit louder, Bob. Now everyone sees all this dumb meme that someone posted in, in memes. <laughs> you mean the padlock one? Nah, not the padlock one. Some, another one. That was a, that's a goat meme. <laughs> 
Who joins at the tennis? Us nerds. Um, so... I think this is Sash. Rocks. Yeah. It's yeah, obviously it's Rocks, but I don't know if it's Sash. I think it's Sash. Some, uh, some HO like this. But yeah, see, you must can, like, can Megan stay in because, like, he has the Intimidate, he traces the Intimidate. Hit him with the HP Ice. I'm not Psychic Ice. <laughs> okay, <here. laughs> okay, sir. But, uh, you can definitely hit him with the Psychic for some massive damage. On the... I actually haven't seen Mega Zem in a while without a Lily on the same team. Yeah, Lando's a threat to see Dumas. I mean, Lando's gonna take a lot though, because, like I said, Zem gets the Intimidate off if it Megas, and then Psychic does like 70, right? Probably. Something like that. It does, it does a lot though. So. But yeah, we have seen uh, see Dumas bring teams like this a few times. Um. Last round, or like the round before that, he had, I think, a Reuniclus instead of a Zem. Like a Magic Guard user plus a plus a Toxic Spikes to absorb, like... Even though Magic Guard user isn't weak to T-Spikes, but like he had like Hazard stack is what I'm trying to say. Um, so he had no Hazard control on his own, but the opponent like had to defog for him because he was just spamming Hazards. Mm -hmm. Damn, that did a lot. That is a hell of a lot, but I guess it's, it's Max attack. Maybe I mean, there's also the option that is um, regular Zen. Regular Zen and Mega Tower. I don't think it's off played. I thought ABR's game earlier and Earthquake did like 50, so like that was off played. Actually, this could be off played as well, but if the Pharaoh was Fizz Death, that could have been off played as well, yeah. If the Pharaoh's more Fizz Death. Oh, but it's the Alexander is, special. That's a wild set. Uh, no, so he was not Yachi on HO, that's interesting. Uh, Yachi is to help a bit with the Majorna Wheatons, I assume. They also like to eat the Ice Beam from Greninja. Like Majora yeah, like really destroys cool. his team, so it makes sense. Um, yeah, after Mimikyu's disguise is after Mimikyu's disguise is broken, um, the yeah, Majora can just run through with the correct coverage. Yep. And with some pride chip on some of the mons. Um, I assume Sijumas is gonna get a rocks up here. You do see he yeah, was I think Sijumas might predict Kanto's rocks and go for his own rocks. Um. I mean, Sijumas is faster anyway. Oh, never mind, he's not. I'm half down, so he's. No, he's <laughs> 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 this is the I didn't sleep dog, which is special. <laughs> yeah, he's not faster, so. Mm. Yeah, yeah, you're right then. Yeah, he, yeah, was, he, was, yeah, he was gonna try to get right rocks up with it in the opposing rocks, so he was right at Dawn Father. Uh, um, so yeah, I assume. I think I can agree with Kanto's play because that. Um, I assume he's gonna go into Zamingtons now because Psychic should kill from here. What did you just call it? Zamington. <laughs> <laughs> Zamington. Because he said Zeming Zamington. Amazing. Why did Lando kill like six months? Nah. Three, two. I mean, he killed an entire squadron basically. I mean, he did like four, uh, 37 to Pharaoh and he killed the Lando. Yeah, that's basically a kill, right? Ooh, the grounder, this is gone. Diggers be like. Oh, Diggs, no. Wait, Koki, okay, tell me if it's if it's like some life or, or choice bad shit, tell me who switches in the earthquake. Tell me one man on C2 Mod that Zemo switches in, yeah. Uh, I'm thinking it's uh, Z move Mimikyu. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess. Like, never any nightmare. Wait, is that gonna go yeah. Zam or Cortana here? I, he, I guess he has the intimidate off. So Ferroson should also. Yeah, I think, yeah, think Zam is fine. Ferroson works too, cause the intimidate. But there's a there's a Magnus on in the back, so he's tempted to not go Ma uh, Ferro. Yeah, um, Zam should be fine. He gets the double intimidate off. He just psychics to get the kill. Um, I don't think Cancer would go hard into AV Mag. He might though. AV Mag sounds like Majorn. I just got f confused for a second. It's fine. <laughs> You I had mean, Mac gets destroyed by Focus Blast. Like it doesn't die from like after the Psychic. Oh, he does go for oh. interesting. So Kanto, if he has okay. U-turn, but he already showed he doesn't. Nah, his last move was Rocks. He doesn't have U-turn. But if he had U-turn, he uh -huh. could go for that for free and like Sinjumas couldn't double on the zone. Is what I'm trying to say. And if he switched, and the U-turn would have got momentum, but he doesn't have it. So he just gets up Rocks. Surprised that he didn't double into like something like T Tower. Yeah, so basically it is. I mean, a lot is really only needed for default. Actually, never mind. T Tower like gets blocked by Flash. Can is T Tower even faster than Zone? Oh, what I question yes. myself here is, 
Like T2 is really it? slow though, and that usually they run bad so um, they run bulk. But yeah, no zone is slow as well. Oh, oh that's max pedaf, okay, so it the probably wasn't E plate. Yeah, yeah, definitely oh. wasn't E plate because earlier when ABI used it was as well it was Yachi. Um earlier when he, uh, ABI used I think it was off plate, it did like half to Pharaoh with off plate. Yachi bug. <laughs> um data Magnezone. It's kinda of embarrassing that I don't know the speed here. So Magnezone is base sixty. Tyranitar is base 61. Oof, both is slow as fuck. But yeah, 61 my AV. Is he 61. No. Uh, Magnezon usually runs um, not max speed as well on um, AV. They run HP investment or some speed dev. Now what I wonder is why was it Rock Sparrow plus like that? That kind of still looked like defensive land. I don't know what that was. Yeah, true. And Maybe and it was defensive land that would protect to stay healthy. But and then did he even have leftovers on that? No, he didn't, didn't have lefty, so it's not protect then. Never mind. Yeah, I don't know what that was. I don't know what that's all about. Um, he was not Yachi either. He was probably Helmut. Oh, he was lefties. Yeah, he, he was lefties. He just got knocked off. Oh. <laughs> oh <laughs> My yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah, so thankfully, I scrolled back there. <laughs> We're both bad. So I assume he's gonna go for a fire punch or earthquake. Um. I mean, if crunch kills that's free as well i don't know if crunch kills because they run hp like they usually i see them run like 156 hp the main zone i would doubt it kills main zone is really good defense so then he's gonna have to go for fire punch but i'm gonna try to calc it as we get the juicy background noise from insult right, i'm so just gonna mute it Taranta, um crunch the 61 to 73 so it doesn't kill it's just an orlando it's a safe play so you can just get his rocks. Yeah, I he guess. was either fire punch or quake. Goose crunch didn't kill. Do most is real. He just hits fire punch on the. Um, the obviously he doesn't have off quake. You either run fire punch or off quake. You run one of the two, and then you run um pursuit crunch and edge and the other move slots. So katana can go for a leaf blade here. Um, Saigo, is, is he banded? Because he went for it so confident that it would kill. I don't know about that. That's kind of. Um, so I'm, I'm a Kagama Shaka, so the, he was defensive land. Right? Uh, it, was a, it was a crit though. So. Yeah, I know, but he went for it, so it would have, as if it would have killed without the without the crit. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I just think he's Scarf and he didn't want to get trapped. Yeah. I think he's just, yeah. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah, but he gets Lando 2 hit KO fast. from Earthquake if Sekrazot didn't kill. I think the Lando was fast. Not defensive. Oh, okay. Fast Yachi. Very interesting. Yeah. It is HO. Ooh, as he goes hard, teacher. And goodbye, Mr. Ladios. So he's gonna drag or defog. Now he's probably um scarf Ladi, so I don't think he has a choice. Like he has to just Isn't drag. He scarf? Huh? He's like scarf. Yeah, he's scarf. He should be scarf. Healing wish and um. Yeah, should be scarf. Like dragging again. The uh, obviously is a decent play because you get more chip on the tower. Not that it really matters. Uh, now there's no. He doesn't have a defog. So Princess is gonna get a knight. Definitely gonna oh, you can go to Diggers V here, right? Or and click off quick. I mean, Diggers V. And Sijumas is gonna sack the Tyranitar. Yeah, Sijumas has no reason not to. As he goes pins here. Um, so he's gonna click frustration. I assume it kills from here. The SD's up. SD's up, knowing it's locked into pursuit. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, so yeah. how much does quick attack do to Zam? I assume it kills or plus two. Yeah, it definitely kills. Uh, so yeah, Spencer should just win now. I forgot about that. Spencer wins here. Sash counter, please. Sash. Well, it doesn't even have to be countered, but Sash. Sash, Zam plus Megatar. The combination. Mega Bantar. <laughs> Mega Bantar, that's it. <laughs> that's a um, Mega Bantar. This might be uh, a you roll. Went into if it. he gets a lower, he might be able to lift this. I'm gonna cock it afterwards. Oh, it's oh, Sash! Yes, it, it actually is. God. The fuck? Bro, it actually is Sash. I mean, I was considering that it could be, but like, that's interesting. I was thinking it would be mega. I mean, it makes this, sense like, to mega. check some stuff. Like, this is like, blanket checks a lot this of. It's like shit. a perfect way Good to God. see why it was. So like, I, like that, I, I, now it makes sense also that he didn't mega turn one on the Zam, uh, on the on the Lando to get intimidated off, huh? Yeah, but that's. I mean, he's, like. He's gonna go to Pax yeah. here on the Shadow Sneak, and if Candor breaks that, he can go for SD. Or double into uh, Magnezone. Like he was always going packs there. Okay. 
Okay. Um, can save the sash, Sam. Um, I, I think he actually potentially was counter on that. So see, Dumps' team is the is an ABR team from Snake. That's what Sed told me. Ooh, again, because the first one also was. So basically, C Doom was just gets his team slurped on by ABR. Oh, trapped! I don't think I don't think secrets are kills. Um, if it's Scarf, yeah, I think it's like the one. It's, 65 it's the team maybe? using as well, oh. Yeah, yeah, I, I saw that game, but um, I saw the replay. I missed it live, unfortunately. I mean, he gets rid of Katana, but... And then it's like a lot of... Wait, Diggersby like... wins, right? Yeah, Diggersby the GOAT, I think... If it's, like if it's not choice, you can quick attack If it's not choice, yeah. And then off quick yeah, attack. Yeah, if it's like life or it wins here. I, mean, I don't Pax, think it should be choice on this team. Pax probably lives a hit. I don't know. Pa Pax has only live life or earthquake from a huge power. There's been no, no, no. Yeah, from, yeah. from Fulham, I might live. Max Maybe for that, the, you think so? Oh. Maybe from the hot squad's pickup. Oh, Max Bedev doesn't live, but I thought he's mixed defensive. <laughs> Imagine it's pickup, he like misclicked. <laughs> yeah, and, then, and then he gets knocked off, and afterwards, said it, he picked up an Oranberry. <laughs> What if he just crits the Do you think Volt Switch killed? I mean, it doesn't matter. He's uh, gonna I, get think so. I think it does, but... I mean, just HP fire, because then you could scout what he goes into next. What? You just go Zam, because Zam gets flexed on by both of the other mods. So you can just if Zam is not HP fire, I was about to say then it has to hit a focus blast, but it is HP fire. Alright, he went into it fast, it's so it's it. probably not Got choice. quick attack here. I mean, yeah, he's, all hard pack. It, I was about to say, if he's choiced, um, then he might have gone for Earthquake. That's definitely sucks. not banded. That's definitely not banded. Mm. Yeah, that's... What was that? Earthplate or something? Silkstar yeah. for something, maybe. Sash? I mean, like, Sash? Nothing, yeah. Yeah. yeah, maybe Sash. Sash, So dude. we're gonna get a game three here. Both of these games are okay, hot gas. Let me pause and put some different music in the background. And let me concentrate on game three because I almost messed up there at the beginning. <laughs> Get back with game three, we got some another banter probably. This is another team that we're using snake, so Sinjima is pulling out all the snake game teams. Um, I mean, it might have been changed a bit, but this was um, the Cox who crashed Heat Ran, Scarf Lari, Band, Tar. Um, Ashko Ninja with Spec Serve. <laughs> I think the Can you repeat that again? I think. What do you mean? Can you repeat the team again? Why? I just want to know. Oh, Cox, Screw Crash, Lando. Uh, Heatran. <laughs> Are you sure it's that? Yeah, Benatar. It's Ashkin Ninja, right? Yeah, Spe Specs, Ashkin with Surf. Defensive Lando. Okay, let me look at the other team. So that could be, um... Nature Party, Yancy, but usually that's only used with Coco. What's the Lando set? Defensive. I think on Sijuma's team. Okay. Yeah. Whose team is it? Is it a, another ABR? Um, it was used by uh, Ben Manafi and it was used by Level 56 and Snake, so I don't know who made it. But it is Torn. If the Pex is released with Death, the Torn could be like I4 by Z move. Yeah. Uh, I'd say it's uh, Scarf Lele on Kanto's team. Seems quite the scary. Nancy is scary. Yeah. Um, four attacks the Nancy. Just, just four attacks as wins. Yeah, I like Diamond Storm, like two at Kyo's turn as well, I think. So he doesn't have good switchings anyway. It's Scarf Lottie, right? Yeah. So the Celsius is definitely defensive and this. Tash Grand is Surf, right? Okay. Lando's the only rocker, um, so I'm thinking that's defensive as well. Scarf Lele and then Life Opus Z move on this. Is the Heat Trend Z move? Corkscrew cr Z oh, yeah, Corkscrew Crash, I use. I mean, it could be a different Z move, but that that's what I have seen at least in the Snake game. It doesn't really do. I mean, I guess it could catch the Lele off guard, but Kanta I mean, probably knows the team. It does a lot to, like, Lando as well. 
and you don't have to risk a magma miss and it probably does a lot to torn but yeah torn doesn't have to stay on tren so I think it's like off paw flash can magma storm and then maybe taunt on the trend or toxic. I forgot the last move. I think this candle's gonna leave it okay, I was gonna say candle's gonna leave with Pex, but no. <laughs> Okay, so the opposing lander is intimidated when first, and the opposing lander is defensive unless he changed the team. So that already tells us that candle lander is really slow, or defensive as well. Uh, I assume he's gonna go to Ferrothorn Aladi here. No. Interesting. Wow. So he gets rid of the lander there. Thought he would switch. That's weird. So Kanzo used a uh, Yanchi like two times now. That's two games, right? I guess it's good versus like the Lando mirrors. Yeah, Lando mirror and versus taking the ice beam from the Journa. True, true. So he's gonna go Pax here. So you must can double into Tyranitar. This is the most obvious double. Wow, yeah. well, he predicted the double, but he went Feral. That was a, I guess, fine mid ground then because you don't want to risk your T Tar. <laughs> mm hmm. So he can leech seed here. Annoying. Uh, he can. Wait, Kanto has no hazard control. Yeah, he's gonna spike then. He's gonna definitely spike because he's no like his only hazard control is having a mega buff DNC <coughs> and bring it in on the correct turn. So Sijuma is gonna get up another layer of leech seed here. Uh, he could also go for a knockoff if he has that. That would be a nice play. Yep. Okay, he's getting up the T-spikes here. I mean, T-spike... Hit the turn the Gren. Yeah, the noise that... Uh, the, uh, the Gren. Which is probably... Was probably gonna be his win con in the end. I feel like he's gonna um, go to Tornadus here. You think Tornadus or just T-spike? I mean, he already has a layup. I don't think he needs two layers in this game. No, a T-spike. Oh, I'm lagging. I'm so far behind. Oh, line. it's fine. I disconnected. I was on like turn five. Oh, nice energy. Okay, one or two two layers. Two layers are fine as well, but I don't think it mattered too much in this game. He wasn't heat turn on the packs, so maybe he changes to tectonic rage. I don't know. But he's just gonna magma storm, I assume, since the packs is lead sheeted. Yeah, since the packs is lead sheeted, turn was a fine play. Yeah, he just magma storms, Lando gets uh, just dies. Uh, if he has superpower, he can go in a torn. But yeah, he goes to the anti and he takes all the hazards. The anti's hazards are putting in work. How oh, else is this Ferrothong? Let me see. Is that full? Um, I think he's. He doesn't lose anything from off powering. Actually, does he? I could see him going for HP fire. Uh, so Jumas wants the trend for for the Celestila. The Celestila is really annoying if he loses trend, so I don't think he's staying in. So I would consider HP firing a potential Ferrothorn. Oh. <clears throat> because Ferro, um, I don't think Ferro dies to off power into no. HP fire, but I think it dies into HP fire into HP fire. He goes Lari expecting an HP fire or off power. Uh, yeah, mainly expecting off power. Okay, if Sasha kills from here, then it was a fine play, but I wasn't sure if Sasha kills. Is it a roll? We kill that. I uh, cocked that. Ladios. Uh, where's DNC? So Sasha does uh, 50 to 59, so maybe he has Psycho. No, you need to calc hasty. You have to calc hasty. Oh, hasty DNC? Yeah. 56 to it's 65, okay. I mean, it's heavily in Canto's just play. Chip on this. He doesn't need Ladios. He doesn't need Ladios, right? Yeah, Ladi is like good to like. Ladi is good to trick the Steeler though. Or um, he, yeah. He, does, he doesn't really need to trick Steeler. I mean, I mean if he, he loses Tran, how does he beat Steeler? Other than Banta, he doesn't really beat it that well. And Banta is gonna get poisoned. 
he has to pressure it. He, like Steel is just looking. Steel is looking really threatening, but I don't think Cedo is. Kanto is gonna let it get tricked. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I think trading it to kill the Diancy is worth it. Who joined? Because if you sty shot here, then Ashgren gets one with Dark Pulse. Right. I mean, Pex, if it's really speed dev, can switch in, I think. It's at 63, bro, after hazards. It's at f oh, 63. I mean, I think that was that, like, 30 to Pex. It lost its leftovers, bro. Okay, okay. But not. It's, so it's he can he can fish he can fish for flinches if it doesn't do it as well. No, it, it definitely do it KOs. It does 33 to 40, so yeah, it should do it KO. Oh, that's the that's a fist death set. How much does Spadev run? Max. Let's say if it's max Spadev, it does 26 to 31. But if it's not max Spadev, it probably gets two it KO. Okay. Uh, it's probably not max Spadev. They usually run a bit of fist death. Oh, ABR runs near max though. I okay. guess you're right. So it might be it's max roll, though. though. It's a roll. Yeah, if it's near max, then it's one and roll, and two, you can also get flinched. ABR runs like. Yeah, let me see what ABR runs. I mean, the thing is, if you keep the DNC. I guess ABR it's a, it's a nice death far. 248, 240. Con. Okay. Yeah, he's goes hard to it, so I think he's max spadev. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he's max spadev. Okay, he's max spadev. Yeah, he's max spadev. Yeah, he's max spadev. Yeah, but it's a roll. <laughs> you get it? Like you said. Mm. Yeah, you said the separate. So, I guess that makes sense because now he doesn't give him Ash Form and he gets some toxic damage off. But Pax is really known now with the hazards because the hazards really much get rid of regen. I think the hazards even do a bit more than regen can heal. Correct. So, he's either gonna go to Scarf Lily or Sal's Dila. Pax is gonna be at 30 when it, when it comes. Yeah. Uh, he can go to Stila and. Okay, okay, he goes to this. So it's gonna U turn or superpower. If this is. Yeah, if this is AV superpower, it just wins. Well, it doesn't win literally. But... <laughs> I mean, Scarf Lily also kind of wins if he gets a bit more chip on the tar, I think. There's a heat ram. Yeah, I know, but like. If it has Focus Blast, it wins as well, but that's rare. <laughs> and you have to hit. <laughs> yeah, but like, he has a few things that annoy Kisijumas, like. Stila annoys him, this it's can too win. Early to call this game. And Lele can win if he wins. It's Trump too early to decide who wins here. Tar. So, like. I think he's U turning. If he, had, if he doesn't have a superpower, obviously, because then. Um, otherwise, if the Tita. traps this, it would be annoying for Kanto. I mean, I don't think he's going hard Tita anyway. He's either going Tren or maybe Ferrothorn if he breaks the U-turn. Yeah, if he breaks the U-turn, he can go Ferrothorn. I don't know why I thought he would go Tar, but that's no option. I mean, if he's really bad, he's really spit off on the pack, so I'm not sure if this is even. Oh god, that sucks. I was about to say, I'm not sure if that is even a V Torn. How much would have Torn, Torn have taken if it's non AV? I think that's a roll even with the crit. Oh, so it was AV then. Okay, okay. Yeah. I'm not gonna call it then. No. No. Actually, never kills AB, so I guess it wasn't. Yeah, he's either gonna protect Britain the Granger to stay in or uh, Leech Seed, Britain a switch. That's not AV Torn. AV Torn always lives crit. Uh, okay, okay. I mean, maybe it's AV with like only a little bit of HP, but it was probably. No, bad. AV with no HP always lives crit. Okay. So it was Life Orb or Z Move. Yeah. Probably Z Move. Because I, I don't see another Z move user because Lily should be Scarf. Um, I can see him double seeding here, but it's too risky. He's probably just going to protect. Um, Sijuma's going Tren, I think. Oh, I would see Lily's keep. I mean, I want to 
let's see the thing. Let's see what's going to keep that way. What if he double leeches? Can CC do a second? Yeah, double leeches is unnecessarily risky. I always checked. Um, yeah. CC do a second. Yeah, it makes sense that he says, but I felt like he, he was. I felt like he was always gonna predict, uh, protect there. He can't risk a double leech. Mm, okay. I think he can just plays out. <laughs> I mean, Mammostom can miss. Yeah, I think Kanto's play is dodge. But U turn, I think U turn would have killed the Greninja with Toxic Spikes. And if it didn't kill the Greninja from the Torn, the U turn, then he could have protected with Steeler after to kill it, probably. So that was unfortunate. Um, was that game deciding? Let me see. Yeah, especially if he has superpower um, to kill Heatran and uh, Tyranitar, then it was really annoying that his, that his Torn got crit. How many storms does he have? Seven. He only used one. Oh, Lele should die with the yeah with the aftermath effect thing. And Pex dies to off power, so yeah, this game is over. He didn't. Hmm. Yeah, he can still dodge, I guess, but he already said GG, so I think it's over. So it's always unfortunate when a game gets decided by that. Okay, now he doesn't. Yeah. Now it's over because he just taunts. Um, if he misses all his magma storms, I guess he could still lose. <laughs> but he he has to miss multiple now. That's so that's one. <laughs> oh, he has to win. He has to miss like a few more. <laughs> so he hits and it's over. Um, it's unfortunate, but yeah. I think Kanto also got like a bit lucky in the. Was it versus Googly last round? Yeah. And didn't Kanto play versus some other friend? Oh yeah, that was versus Kick as a like two rounds ago. And the also got a bit lucky there. Not sure if that mattered though. But yeah, this hex definitely mattered at the end. So yeah, we got uh Sijuma moving on to the next round of OT loser bracket. I think it's round seven. Is it loser semis next round? Yes. Okay, and uh Karen versus I forgot it's the winner thing. Karen versus CL is for winners. And the loser of uh, Karen vs. CL uh, plays the winner from winner's bracket then? Wait, winner's no, it's, bracket? It's, lo it's loser's quarters next round. Oh, okay, 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 never mind then. It's so then, so the, the guys from winner's bracket then have to wait. Um, wait, no, no, no. I, I, yeah. It's the guys have to wait then until the loser's bracket has caught up. Yeah. And I mean, Karen has been performing really well. I think Karen is going to win with CL, but we shall see. So thank you for watching and see you must win two and one, but it's really annoying if, like the game that all that decides everything is uh with hacks have hacks in it. Yeah, thanks to my guests and goodbye. And